Everyone fears losing their mind. Disease, loneliness, trauma, prolonged pressure, time. There are countless ways our minds can meet oblivion long before our bodies. So we invent routines that can hopefully carry us from and back to our pillows intact. Slicing up the days into chunks that can be more easily digested. We toil away and pretend it gives us purpose, supporting lives we hope are stable and relieve ourselves with smaller, more manageable oblivions. When we become dissatisfied with the process, we try to rebalance our needs. Less dairy, more gym, less booze, more weed, less gym, more dairy, etc. But the balancing act never ends. The cycle never stops. Sanity is a construct, an artificial invention of humanity. And like all constructs from the mightiest skyscraper to a Lego house, it must be maintained. When your maintenance fails and the edifice crumbles, you will realize that the creeping dark comes not from without, but within. Sanity was always the unnatural state. Sanity was the invader. At the end of that long entropic road, when all your humanity and sense is withered away, only the madness remains. And a strange but true. Hey, what a hell of a Detroit! Alright guys, I'm your host Recurring here, and as you may have guessed, this is the Dread X Collection. I'm only going to do a little demo on each one, uh, just to give you guys a feel for what you may encounter. But today, we are going to do... Ooh, what's this one? Ooh, we are going to try the Pony Factory. Alright, let's head on in and see what this is about. Winston arrived at a solution to the moral decay of his town. He called out to a hell in a secret candlelit room one evening, and hell answered him. The human body could, Hal promised, be twisted, stretched, and broken into a kinder, more equine shape. The human heart molded into something less human. Winston's town now filled with the cruel and ignorant could instead be filled with magic ponies. If he could provide a factory in which to make them. Winston thought they could be beautiful, gentle, and good. Hell, what other plans? Ooh, and we have a monochromatic world. Very nice and grayscaled. There we go, we have control of something. Uh, nope. Oh, it's Pinkton. Oh, it's you clicky clicking. No. Okay. Damage wall. Um. So I'm assuming this is the factory then. Ooh, what's this? What is this? Oh, whatever it is, I have it. And 
there is literally nowhere to go. Okay. Nice laugh. And ah, the way is opened. Uh, look for the unlocked or complete an area. Oh, okay. Help this. Right. What is this? I found the locked door. Unlocked door, rather. Okay. Hold oh, left mouse at fire. Oh, it's a bolt gun I've got. Okay, okay. Hard to redo, and my ammo's full. Okay. Exploding skeletal unicorn. Right, okay. That's a thing. Uh, let me get this locked. You what? Uh, I don't really want to walk on that. Um, can I? Can I turn you offy? Yeah, I guess it would actually disrupt the whole thing. Great. Oh, shift to walk slow. Slow. No, Zacky Taps. Oh. I thought this is water. Obviously, it's not. Can I do anything with this? No. Okay. Anything? Nothing. Seriously, what is actually creating this? Because there's nothing on the floor. Apart from cracks. There's going to be someone lurching in here. Especially with any bits of light now and again. Yeah, the clicker gets back. I know it's going to jump scare me. Well, that's a whole lot of trouble. Midkits. Midkits. <laughs> that took a lot of ammo. I nearly went into the hull. Why did it sound like I opened a bottle or something? I'm stuck on the wall. Eesh. That was ended badly. Any goodies here? No. Oh my. More zaps. Sid. Well, how dare you! Oh. And now I get the light. But well, where the heck was it then? <sighs> Fine. Alright, do I have any more medkits that I can pick up? Because that was annoying. Oh, yes, there is a medkit. <coughs> Lovely. And naturally that's locked. Yeah, I am not jumping down there. And definitely get me killed. I thought that was a horseshoe then. Oh. Okay, so I guess the 
Orsa's garden, the only exit. Uh, if you're running, oh, backtracked. Okay, so I can go to previous rooms again? Nice. Anything I can utilize. Anything else? <laughs> no that was annoying. I got stuck in the wall. Off it. How did you get me through a wall? <sighs> okay, let's so I'm gonna have to kill. Oh, come on. <laughs> well, that happened. Okay, so there was ammo here, which I can't pick up. There we go. standing up. That's not fair. A bipedal unicorn. Skeleton. Thing. Hmm. Let's go this way first. That's always a good start. Anything else? Nope. Yeah, of course you'd be lacked. I did that corner want to light up at all. That's annoying. And nothing at all on these shelves. Nope. Well then. Oh. So they're still running unicorns as well, or a bipedal new one. You right. What other tricks are you gonna throw my way? Skittery scuttery bug? Mm, 
no ammo. Nope, no ammo. Oh. Oh, crap. Get away. It's so weird how they just explode. Oh, it's lighter. Fire and burst, maintain accuracy, or get up close and personal. What? Oh, great, more, more magic keys. Uh. I see you. Ooh, you take a lot of health. How dare you? Uh, what the? There's more than one. Oh, are you kidding me? I gotta start that again. There's one or more of the wizard unicorns. Okay, that ended in disaster go straight there. So Oh yeah, there was ammo. Oh. Okay, so I don't need that. It's a little sucker punch. <laughs> Okay, so this free. Hmm. Okay. So there's Okay, there's one more somewhere. Ooh, you take a lot of damage. Damn, that's like all of it gone. Alright, let's see if I got some health or some ammo. It's not exactly what I need, but. Ooh, is that it? Yeah. Door! Of course, it's locked. on the stairs. Yeah, let's not. Oh, that's more health. Very useful. Use cover to avoid projectile damage. Fair enough. No, trust me, I'm not gonna like this if that's a warning I'm given. No! I am not! After all, oh, I was gonna say there's gonna give me nothing then, but no, nope, there is ammo. No health. I got it down with the health. Okay, I know there's one around the corner. I can hear the squishy scratch. Or it could just be them. Oh, of course you. Hmm. All right, 
Oh, let's try this one more time. There's a lot of the unicorns on that last little section. Well, it's going to be a pain that rare to deal with. Why did that lot let me shoot them? That was annoying. <laughs> mm, I guess I got him. All right, rub it in my face. That was a lousy attempt. Up and close and personal. Goodness gracious, great balls of meat. Ah, of course, you'd run out. Where are you hitting? Seriously. Come here, you little... Come here. Step ready, riding. It's almost like he didn't want to get shot. Alright, that's help here. Off, and then we'll uh, try and deal with the other savages. Okay, there's I mean there, but I won't get that just yet. Alright, let's pick this up. Uh, these were not suitable. That one wasn't. No health. Oh yeah, this was the uh, pay the neck bit. Hello. <laughs> he wanted to come close. Can't see any others. It's knowing that they're not affected by uh, the uh, lightning flower. I found the door. Finally. And this is ominous. 
I shall see if that... Ah! Damn it! I forgot a switch. Okay, so let's go get the ammo. That took a lot of my health. I think I got it. Nope, I did not get it. Alright, where are you old sod? Did you just teleport out of existence? Nope, he's up there. Sounds like he's having a panic attack out there. Hey, ours. Any other goodies? No. Okay. That's obviously not going to be the right door. But we'll try anyway. Okay, that's ominously dark. Oh. <laughs> it wasn't ominous at all. Alright, okay, it's Stairway of Doom. Oh, we're gonna get dizzy going down all this lap. Ooh. Anything else? Can I crouch? Alright, where are ya? We know you're gonna be in here, because the music's stepping up. And this light source is getting rubbish. Okay, so we're actually going up for a change. Oh, I'm stuck on the steps. Bye. 
back up there, bro. Oh, no, that's not what I was aiming for, but hey, we'll go for that. Okay, there must be a boss coming soon if I give me that amount of ammo. Check around, make sure there's no other health packs. Mm, nope. I mean, just how big is this place? I mean, this is getting ridiculous. Of course. Back off, boy. Back off. Bad wussy. Okay, now I need to get the ammo. Oh, okay, that was the door. Nice. Bad thing. It's only light around. You know, I'm gonna die as soon as I reach this door. It wasn't a door. Ooh, there's color. Well then, uh, but no packs of anything. So There's no subtle hum. No, I'm just gonna switch. I had a feeling that was gonna come, but I was gonna expect the uh, bipedal one. Give me any ammo or anything though. Oh, hang on, is that it? I just wasn't looking. Things are actually working here. Okay. The yellow door was a fake door. That does not look right. Oh, hang on. This is the factory where they get walked. Are they hanging? Oh boy. The thing you seek lies at the heart of the pony maker. Uh, so basically, you have to get ripped to shreds. Okay, now oh, let's just take. Do I need to destroy these things? Nope, it's impossible to. Oh well, into the jaws of death. Or not. What? This is what you've been searching for. Take it. This is gonna be really bad, but hey, let's go for it. Let's just touch the glowy thing. Uh, what now? You have what you came for, now escape. What did I come for? Uh, 
I wanna know if there's any more of the horsemen. Check downstairs to see if there's any health kits. No, that's ammo. I want health. As I ain't gonna get far on five. Hello. Sounds like a metric ton down there. <laughs> it shot me through a wall. Oh well, on that one, uh Well, anyway, uh, that was your little demo for Pony Factory. I uh, hope you enjoyed, and uh, let's see if you can actually do better than what I did. I'll see you in the next episode. Bam on shadows.